This is Du. She was born at Cheetah Experience and another valued member of the breeding project. She's 10 months old in this clip, and I've known her off and on for the past four years. Good girl. Look at that, look at my face. Well, that's, that's like sandpaper. Wow. And it's got chicken smell. Oh, I don't need a razor anymore. Just get her. This was my very first encounter with Dew. Oh she loves everybody. Luckily, I have, I have six o'clock six o'clock shadow. She was friends with Gabriel for a couple of years until they broke up. I joke. They're just playing here. They had to be separated a year later due to maturity. There you go, sweet. There you go. I also spent some time feeding Dew. The cub years are when cheetahs imprint on their mother or their caretakers. Though I didn't spend a lot of time with her, I've bound to have some effect on Dew. One of my favorite cats, because she's so affectionate like this. Coming up, one of my reunions with Dew nearly two years later. Sweet Cheetah. Hello, too. Hello. Uh, she's about, about a little three years old now. Listen to her. Her name's Dew. Extremely nice Cheetah. Dew was allowed inside the public yeah, area for enrichment. She decided to use her free time visiting me. She just absolutely loves attention. Incredible. I have noticed that she was uh, about maybe eight months old. Off and on. She could almost be a, uh, an ambassador cheetah, but she has a couple things that uh, nullify her from that. One is she does slap sometimes. <laughs> and what else? What else do? She, uh, she wants to come to you and not you, you go to her, basically. She doesn't like uh, close cuddling with her face. Right, sweetie. Now watch this. Move the camera, the camera a little bit. <laughs> I'm like a magnet. <laughs> I'm a cheetah magnet. <laughs> Good girl, too. I'm a cheetah magnet. No, he's just such a special, he's a very special cheetah. Very special cheetah. Very special. Oh, it's just so close. Oh. All right, let's do a purr. Only a purr now. It's shedding too, it's summer here. Actually, it's quite a nice day today, it's, uh, it rained. There you go too. Actually, like, let's get really close, isn't this sweet? Let's get really close. Now, I've been warned, I, I haven't known Dew real well in the last two years. And I was warned not to get near her face, unless she gets in my mind. Uh, I don't know how she'll react. I said, I don't know her real well, but I, know, I know she's a nice cheetah. As long as you respect her, you know, nothing's gonna happen with me or her. As long as I she comes to me, I let her do her thing, and I don't force anything on her. That's respect. 
Alright, do. I do. Do, do. do. And people do. I want, I want you facing the camera, sweetie. Face and do. That's you sweet. And that's it. Loves a groom. Oh, she loves a groom. I know. She's small for a size. Stop. I guess maybe 60 pounds, maybe. Here she comes. Sweet do, sweet do, sweet do. Get this out of her. There we go. There we go. Jesus. She is just super sweet, man. I love you. I've known her, like I said, I've known her about two years, but I really haven't spent a lot of time with her. She's always been in a camp I couldn't uh, visit. And she is now too, she's in a camp I can't visit. It's so good to see you, dude. It's so good to see you. Yeah, it's so good to see you. She may be done. That's about a 10 minute cheetah. 10 minute attention, then she's done. Right. And she'll tell you when she's had enough, she'll look in your face. And you just back off. I've seen it before where she would uh, stare right in your eyes and widen her, widen her eye, eyebrows. And then she doesn't want any more interaction, so you back off. She has been known to slap. Not mean, they just telling you, know, it's her way of communicating because she doesn't speak English human. Right, dude? She doesn't speak human. So you have to read their language. Right, dude? People often ask me what a cheetah feels like. In their chest area where I'm scratching and on top of their head, it's very woolly. It's nothing like a house cat or leopard, which is very soft. Along their back and sides, it's more sleek and silky to the touch. In winter, their undercoat thickens and becomes fluffy. The larger the black spots are on a cheetah, the softer they feel. That's because the black hairs are finer than the golden or white. You're definitely a people cheater. A pe the people's cheater. I do. I love the counters. Very sweet. I like this all the time. If you want a couple of cheetahs, just do as it. Who's the answer? All right, sweetie. This is so close. Okay. Oh. I just do a purr. I want a purr now. If you like this video, please share it and give it a thumbs up. And consider joining my channel. Join my coalition and subscribe.